Works for You Sports, driven by your Oklahoma Ford dealers. Welcome into sports, everybody. Mike Holder, you have some explaining to do. After one successful season, the Brad Underwood era already over for Oklahoma State basketball. Underwood hired away by the University of Illinois today. The news breaking this afternoon, only about 25 hours after OSU's season-ending loss to Michigan. Underwood, who went 20-13 and 13 in his one season with the Pokes, calling the job at Illinois a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. He made about a million dollars this year, less than any other Big 12 coach. We all expected a contract extension would be forthcoming, but word is those talks did not go well. Part of the IBA family coaching tree, Underwood thought to be a perfect fit in Stillwater. His first season only confirmed that optimism for the fan base. They loved him. Now, not so much, at least on social media this afternoon. Yesterday, after the game, talking to Big Al Underwood certainly did not sound like a coach on his way out the door. Now I'm proud um, to have complete buy-in from 15 guys in your first year get to the NCAA tournament, man, I, they've made it so um, enjoyable for, for myself and our staff. All right, so who's next? Hard to know who might or might not be on Mike Holder's shortlist, but we do know that one former player would love this job. Doug Gottlieb tweeting this picture today. Dorothy from the Wizard of Oz, there's no place like home. Doug would love to come back. Here's what the great Eddie Sutton had to say one year ago about Gottlieb potentially getting the OSU job. Doug, Doug is smart. I think he'd be a great recruiter, and I think that uh, if he's smart enough to get good assistant coaches, I think he'd be all right. When you were at Central, did you teach in the classroom? Well, Bill Self is uniquely positioned to comment on the Underwood move. Of course, Self played at OSU, and he coached at Illinois for three seasons. He weighed in this afternoon. Well, I just heard it. I just heard it 10 minutes ago, so it, it shocks me. I think it would shock most people. Uh, because obviously, uh, you know, Brad was on a roll, I thought, in Stillwater, and, and uh, a lot of great things had transpired in the short time he's been there. So, you know, without knowing any details, I don't know what else to say. I mean, if, if that's, you know, congratulate him, and, 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 uh, but certainly uh, not discourage uh, Oklahoma State from still moving forward. I mean, because it, it's certainly the program's certainly in better shape than it was a year ago. 